The Outpatient Infusion Center at Salinas Valley Health offers infusion services for all types of patients, but especially cancer patients. Joining me today to tell us more about the center is Elena Hermosillo. She's an oncology nurse with Salinas Valley Health. This is Ask the Experts, the podcast from Salinas Valley Health. I'm Scott Webb. Elena, thanks so much for your time today. I know that you're an oncology nurse, so let's just start here. What does that mean? What do you do? An oncology nurse is a healthcare professional who administers chemotherapy, biotherapies, and immunotherapy treatments to cancer patients. We have expertise, and we understand the various types of cancer and their treatment options for our patients. We use our clinical knowledge and clinical expertise to ensure that patients and family understands what is happening to their bodies, ensuring that, you know, their treatments are going well. And also, we address patients' physical needs. We also address their emotional well-being. We listen to their concerns. We ask questions. And we connect them with services, you know, if they need any type of service, for example, like social worker, nurse navigators, who can help them with their mental health, as well as financial and family stresses that comes with a cancer diagnosis. But let me tell you, also, being a nurse in oncology, we're also friends to our patients over time. We develop a nurse and patient relationship, which is the beauty of being an oncology nurse is that we get to form those friendships. We celebrate holidays, birthdays, milestones when completed their treatments, but also we grieve and we experience setbacks with them as well. We grieve losses, but ultimately we are friends to the patients and their families. And overall, that's what an oncology nurse is. We know that cancer diagnosis is a journey, sometimes a long journey, and I'm sure it's a comfort to patients and families to have these friendly, compassionate, expert you know, nurses along this journey with them. So just broadly speaking, what is an outpatient infusion center? What does that mean? An infusion center is an ambulatory outpatient setting that we provide treatments, especially anything that has to go into the bloodstream. So infusions mean fluids going into the person's bodies. So we are experts at doing treatments that go in their system. So we're specialized in starting IVs, accessing ports and central lines. And like I mentioned, we're specialized in oncology treatments, but we also offer other type of treatments for other patients in our community, antibiotics, infusions, transfusions, platelets, and it's an outpatient ambulatory setting outside the hospital. So we are a clinic that we provide these type of services. So anything that has to go to the systemic blood system, yeah. that's what we provide. Right. Not just cancer, other types of infusions, of course. So let's talk specifically about the Salinas Valley Health Outpatient Infusion Center. What services do patients receive? Where is it located in relationship to the hospital and perhaps the other cancer clinics as well? So Salinas Valley Health Infusion Center opened in May 2019, right before pandemic. We offer treatments for our community and it's been growing. Even through pandemic, we have increased our services The center has a total of 14 infusion chairs, so it's a very large facility. And each infusion chair has their recliner, their TV. We just make it very comfortable for the patients who are going to be there for whichever length of treatment it is, because sometimes treatments can be short, sometimes they can be long, as long as eight hours it can be. So we make the treatments as comfortable as possible. We also have three private rooms that we use for highly sensitive cases and for more privacy for some patients. The infusion center is located right across the hospital, the main hospital, and it's right next to the oncology and hematology specialists, which we work very closely with. Yeah. So we are just right next door. So if we need any type of support from our oncologists and hematologists, we are right next door. Yeah, you're all right there, and certainly that makes it convenient or more convenient anyway for patients and families. So let's talk about really what makes it so special. You know, who can use the services? How do you make an appointment? But especially, what's so special about the Salinas Valley Health Outpatient Infusion Center? We have an amazing staff. We have bilingual staff. We have clerks that are very efficient and very fast at registering patients, accessing 
their referrals. And also we offer phlebotomy services to our patients. So a lot of our patients require that we draw blood right before treatments to make sure that they're doing okay before treatment starts. So we have access to three certified phlebotomists that are there at all times to draw blood. We have amazing pharmacists on site who are always working closely with the technicians, the pharmacy techs, and mixing chemotherapies and immunotherapies and any type of treatments that they need to mix. We also have a mid-level provider on site who is there at all times whenever we need help with medical questions and also assisting patients with their medical needs and assisting us as nurses with, you know, facilitating medical or clinical questions that we have. Sure. We have a team of 11 nurses and all of us are oncology nurses. We are certified in oncology and immunotherapy and we are very knowledgeable in cancer treatments, but as well as in infusion nursing. Most of us hold our bachelor's degrees in nursing and half of us have national certification in oncology knowledge. Yeah, and I wanted to circle back here. Let's talk about who can use the services, how easy is it to make an appointment, and so on. Anybody in our community can be referred to our infusion center. It has to be a referral from the doctor. We see a lot of different patients from different specialties. We see a lot of gastro patients, patients who are having difficulties with their GI system. We get referrals from them. We give treatments for rheumatoid arthritis. We give also treatments for osteoporosis. So in general, anybody can go to our infusion center as long as they're referred by their provider. Okay. And to make an appointment. So first it has to come from a referral sent to our clinic and then our clerk's And our staff process them, make sure that, you know, they're the correct orders, that everything's in line with insurance and authorization. And then we see them. But yes, anybody in the community can be referred to the infusion center. Yeah, that's great. And it's been really nice to get to know you and learn more about the Salinas Valley Health Outpatient Infusion Center today. And as we wrap up here, Elena, just give you an opportunity because we know, you know, patients have choices. They don't necessarily have to go to Salinas Valley Health for treatments that they may need or infusions and things. What would you recommend to them? Why would you want them to come where you work? We definitely understand a diagnosis of cancer that is very difficult and frightening. And we're there. Our nurses are very compassionate. All of our staff are very caring. And I feel that our center provides a lot of that personal care. And it's just not just medical. We offer compassion. And we build friendships and relationships with our patients. And I think it's that connection with the community and with our patients and their families that makes us very special. And... When you walk into Infusion Center, we always greet patients with a smile and Mm. kindness. And what we, all of us as nurses and staff, what we love is that connection that we build with each one of them and their families. Their journey is our journey, and we celebrate any milestone or any setbacks. We're there. And I think it's that personal care that we provide that makes us stand out and definitely welcoming and compassionate. Yeah. Yeah, it sounds like it. We know that a cancer diagnosis is never welcomed. It's never easy. It is a journey, sometimes a long journey. And having, again, these compassionate experts with smiles on their faces to celebrate the good and help during the bad and, you know, just everything else along the way, along that journey, I'm sure patients and their families really appreciate it. So I thanks so much for your time today. You stay well. Thank you. You as well. And if you found this podcast to be helpful, please be sure to tell a friend, neighbor, or family member and subscribe, rate, and review this podcast, and check out the entire podcast library for additional topics of interest. This is Ask the Experts from Salinas Valley Health. I'm Scott Webb. Stay well, and we'll talk again next time.